In order for security to tightly integrate with DevOps, instead of acting as a roadblock, it needs to fit into the current processes. The shift left tool is easily inserted into existing CI-CD pipelines to automatically provide security checks during the testing stages. It involves code analysis for any type of code and security posture management for Terraform configuration files. There are two options for using this tool. One is to run it as a container used as an agent, and the other is as a binary that can be installed in any agent machine managed by your CI server. This video will demonstrate using shift left binary. Here I have a CI CD pipeline that builds an app and a Docker image and uses Terraform to deploy it. Jenkins is used as the CI server, but shift left actually integrates with any CI server, such as GitHub Actions, Azure DevOps, Circle CI, GitLab, AWS Code Pipeline, and more. There are three blades currently available in the shift left tool that will be verifying the security during the testing stage. The first is CodeScan. This does source code security and visibility into the risk analysis for projects. It will check out all the files which are the source code for this Node.js application that we're using in this demo. Next, we have an image scan blade. This scans container images for security risks and vulnerabilities. And in this demo, we have a Docker file being used to build a container for the Node.js application that will be scanned. The third blade is called IAC Assessment, and it scans infrastructure as code templates that enable DevOps and security teams to identify insecure configurations before deployment. Let's go to our Jenkins where a pipeline was created, and we will build now. Let's have a look at the console. The first step is to check all the files from GitHub. Shift left automatically scans all the content of the GitHub repository. The recommendation is block because it found credentials as well as vulnerabilities. There was actually two malware that was discovered. And shift left code scanner is unique in that it does not only detect credentials and CVEs, but also malware. In this case, there is a backdoor and a Trojan that was injected into the source code. Once there is a fail, the pipeline will stop. You'll get a code approval request. It asks your approval to move forward. And this ensures that there are no misconfigurations in the environment. So we're gonna move on to the next stage, but in real life, when you encounter a block with such high severity security issues, you would obviously fix it before continuing the pipeline. The Docker build will build the container image that is using the web app Node.js source code. Shift left scans the container image, and these are the results. We used a Node.js open source container from Docker Hub, and we injected malware buried very deep into the layers of the container. Shift left found the malware that was in the source code. It also found a lot of CVEs with critical and high severities. A report is generated on the CloudGuard portal to show a graphical representation of this result and will give you the ability to filter by severity, malware, or so forth. We will proceed to demo the Terraform scanner now. So with this Terraform configuration file, I'm deploying an S3 bucket. And I'm going to enforce a rule that I want from my policy that any S3 bucket should have server-side encryption. Now this S3 bucket that's being deployed does not. And this error shows that. We tested out a specific rule, but you can also test entire rule sets against your configuration files. These rule sets are built into CloudGuard and range from industry compliance frameworks to security best practices to custom rules for unique requirements. To summarize, Shift Left provides code analysis of code and container images, as well as security posture management of configuration policies in Terraform. It tightly integrates with current DevOps processes easily being added into the CI-CD pipeline.